Today I want to show you a little bit more about the version 2.9 update. On the one side, we have the ePlan platform. Quite an interesting tool, the ePlan platform, because it allows us across engineering disciplines, so from the fluid, from the electrical, from the panel build, from the PNID process people, to share the same data. The same metadata is shared within one project, all at the same time working on the same project. We can all dump this into the ePlus. The two major platform tools, standalones, that are being used very often is the electric P8, historically very oftenly used, and the Pro Panel that concentrates on the 3D. If we dig a little bit deeper into it, we can see that we have a few different options we can add to either the electric P8 or add to the Pro Panel. I created a small overview here to actually look into what we could add to either or. So the first up is the electric P8 package. The electric P8 package comes either in compact select, not selector, select package and professional package. And you can see the differences between them lays in a few different options. So first of all, the compact is only limited to 40 pages. The other ones are unlimited. Now, all of these systems are typically handling 2D panel layouts, unless you add the Pro Panel here, and you can optionally add the Pro Panel professionally to do your 3D mounting layout, to do the NC drilling patterns, to do the step import and export. Now let's concentrate a little bit deeper into the select and professional. We can see here that the select has one, two, three, four options. The, these are called elements. Element collaboration with the revision management is actually included in the professional and is also included if you take the pro panel standalone professional. This includes the revision management, the change of standard, and the translation module. Quite interesting when you have multiple people working on the same project. Now, when you handle PLCs, you're going to add the Select Plus. The Select Plus is an option in Select, is included in the Professional Electric P8. Also is an option on the Standalone Pro Panel. Above all of these systems, you can see that we have some common options. Professional Plus, Ultimate are options we can add to all of these systems. If you take the Pro Panel Standalone Professional, we are moving a little bit further. It's the same as if you take one of these electric P8 packages and you add the Pro Panel Professional add-on. So this basically means that we have 3D mounting layout, NC drilling, and step import export, and we can add some elements. The most popular one is a routing and production. So if you have a Rital WT uh, wire terminal process machine, or you want to use the smart wiring, you should use the routing and production. This is what will calculate the length of each of your wires. This is the most popular one we typically add to the Pro Panel standalone. You have a couple of other ones like the copper design wire production for non retail machines and production DXF, um, which also are for non retail NC drilling machines. To all of the above, we can add, of course, add-on modules related to the automated engineering, the co-engineer add-on. We can add the e-plan pre-planning, and we can add the fluid add-on. So of course, I can't go in every one of these individual features and explain them. You have to look at your e-plan export and trust them a little bit, ask them to demo this. Um, so I hope this explains a bit better what we have as elements, add-ons, and standalone packages within the new version 2.9. Otherwise, ask your ePlan specialist, call up those people directly from our websites. You can find the company addresses, names, and they will actually dig into it. So this was the ePlan platform, in particular the 2.9 update, how we envision giving you exactly what you need so you don't basically overkill your purchase.